Hey guys, this video is about locking and unlocking your 2021 Ford Bronco. I hope you guys enjoy it. And it's pretty, you know, it's, there are things, there are things you don't know about unlocking and locking. But this just, this video just touch it. There's a lot of things you do know, but anything that you may not know that's going to be in this video. Enjoy. <laughs> Doors and locks of the 2021 Ford Bronco. Now operating the doors from the outside of your vehicle. Unlocking the doors using the remote control. You can only use the remote control when your vehicle is stationary. So. Now unlocking the doors, you press the button to unlock all doors. Now there's a button on your key. You press it. Now inside of it, too, there's a button that looks like a lock opening as you can see in this picture you press that now locking the doors press the button to lock all doors one short flash of the turn signal lamp confirms that your vehicle has been locked so when you lock it with the key as well fob you hit it once and one short flash of the turn signal indicate that is locked now operating doors from inside your vehicle and that's from the outside now inside, unlocking and un unlocking the doors using a central locking. The power door lock control is on the driver's door. Press the button to unlock all doors. Press the button, press the uh, lock button to lock all doors. Now the central locking only operates if the front doors are fully closed. So. Those two buttons will not operate if the front doors are not fully closed. Individually locking and, and unlocking the doors using the locking button. Now, locking button, as you see, the power door lock control is on the driver and the front passenger door panels. So you'll see A, for unlock and B for lock. You'll see it on the on the door. On the driver's door and on the passenger door. A unlock and B lock. Now there's also an auto unlock feature. Auto unlock is an unlocking feature that unlocks the uh, vehicle doors when your vehicle comes to a stop. So auto unlock requires all doors down um, auto unlock unlock all doors when all of the following occur the ignition is on all the doors are closed and your vehicle is moving at a speed greater than 12 miles per hour so the auto lock will work and lock your doors your vehicle comes to a stop and you open the driver's door within 10 minutes of switching the ignition off are to the accessory position. So all the following have to occur. The ignition is on and all the doors are closed and your vehicle is moving at a greater speed than 12 miles per hour. Or your vehicle comes to a stop. You open the driver's door within 10 minutes of switching the ignition off are to the accessory position. Now switching the auto unlock on and off. Press the menu button on the steering wheel to enter the information display. Man menu. Select setting, select vehicle, select locks, switch auto unlock on or off. And that's a cool feature. Sometimes you may want the auto unlock to be on, but if you're in a situation where you don't want it unlocking, then just follow those steps. It's actually five steps. Press the menu button, select setting, select vehicle, select locks, and switch to auto unlock on or off. Now auto lock, auto lock is a locking feature that locks your vehicle doors when you start driving. Now auto lock, it locks all the doors 
when all the following occur. All the doors are closed, the ignition is on, and your vehicle reaches a speed greater than 12 miles per hour. Mislock. Mislock is a locking feature that warns you if your vehicle has not locked. And it has limitations. Now when you press the lock button once, the direction indicators do not flash. Now any doors or the tailgate is open or the hood is open. If you switch mislock off, the horn does not sound if you press the lock button on the remote when the door is open. So if the door is open, the horn will not sound. Now switching mislock on and off. Press the menu button on the steering wheel to enter the information display. Main menu. Go to setting. Select vehicle. Select locks. Switch mislock chirp on or off. Now if something goes wrong, this is the troubleshooting. Your door jar warning lamp. It illuminates when you switch the ignition on. It remains on if any of the doors or the hood is open. Now information messages. When it says the, these are the information messages. Driver's door jar. The display if the door is open. And what you do is fully close the door. The passenger door jar. Where left door is a jar and right door is a jar. These are nice features for the doors and the locks. Now, one of the frequently asked questions is can accessories such as steps or handles be used with a latch assembly? And do not use the door latch assembly to attach any accessories such as handles, steps. This can cause damage to your vehicle, so don't do that. Or don't hook anything up to it. There it is, the uh, doors and the locks, folks, of the 2021 Ford Bronco. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, remember, like, share, and subscribe, and have a fantastic day. This is Automotive Reviews. Thanks for watching, sharing, and subscribing. And have an awesome and fantastic day. Much love. And again, thanks for coming by.